Hi, my name is MJP, and the story goes, does it really matter where we are in the Milky Way? Can knowing our place in this vast cosmic ocean change our perspective of the universe or even ourselves? These are the questions that astronomers Carl Sagan and Neil deGrasse Tyson have grappled with, and their views are intriguingly different. Carl Sagan, the renowned astronomer and science communicator, famously claimed that our solar system resides in the outskirts of the Milky Way in the Sagittarius arm. In his view, we are far from the bustling center, living on the edge, so to speak. Sagan's perspective, if embraced, can evoke a sense of humility, reminding us of our small, albeit significant, place in the cosmos. On the other hand, Neil deGrasse Tyson, another influential astronomer and science communicator, offers a contrasting view. According to Tyson, our solar system is situated closer to the center of the Milky Way, specifically in the Orion arm. This viewpoint suggests a more central role for our solar system in the grand scheme of the galaxy. So who's right? Is it Sagan with his edge-dwelling perspective or Tyson with his more central viewpoint? Or could there be a third option that hasn't been considered yet? The truth is, it's not about who's right or wrong. The story of our place in the Milky Way is more complex and nuanced than a simple either-or scenario. The positions of Sagan and Tyson reflect their interpretations of the available data and their perspectives on our place in the universe. The real takeaway here isn't about choosing sides. It's about recognizing that our understanding of the universe is constantly evolving. As we gather more data and develop new technologies, we refine our models and theories. Both Sagan's and Tyson's views are part of this ongoing process of discovery. So the next time you gaze at the night sky, remember this. Whether we're on the edge or near the center, we're part of a vast, beautiful, and ever-evolving universe. We're on a journey of cosmic exploration and there's so much more to discover. In the grand scheme of things, what matters most isn't our physical location in the Milky Way, but our willingness to question, explore, and understand the cosmos. As Carl Sagan once said, we are a way for the cosmos to know itself. And that's a pretty amazing thought, isn't it? This debate between Sagan and Tyson serves as a reminder that science is not a set of fixed truths, but a dynamic process of questioning, discovery, and understanding. It's a conversation that continues to evolve as we learn more about our universe. I'm MJP, signing off, but the journey doesn't end here. Keep looking up, keep asking questions, and remember, we live in a cosmic bubble. Stay curious, and until next time, explore the universe.